Hey guys, Allison Kiever coming at you with a quick training. I uh, wanted to share something with you that happened to me today. Uh, it just kind of proof that uh, wearing your colors and talking to people and follow up are all very important and integral in building a successful AdvoCare business. I was at Costco today and as you can see I was wearing my Advo gear like we do oftentimes whenever we go out of the house and uh, someone called over to me and said, hey AdvoCare, come here, come here, I, want, I have a lot of questions, I want to talk to you. And so of course I, you know, greeted this gentleman with a big smile on my face and I went over to him and asked him how I could help him and he said, you know, I've, I'm seeing AdvoCare all over the place. I, I see a couple of my friends posting about it on Facebook and um, in fact there was someone that uh, came in here before and she gave me a sample of Spark and, uh, and she actually took my name and number but she never followed, she never called me or followed back up with me and I'm really interested in doing um, that program that you have that leans you out. And I said, that's great, that's the 24 day challenge. And uh, you know, I shared with him a little bit about the 24 day challenge. Uh, I, I gave him a spark that I had in my purse that had um, our, my name on it uh, with our info. This is, this is what we give people. It's just a little mailing label. We've always got those available on us and handed that to him. But as I handed it to him, I also gave, uh, I also made sure that I got his phone number and his information. But a couple of training nuggets that I wanted to highlight for you guys. And the first one was, is that, you know, wear your colors because people are hearing about AdvoCare out there and all because I was wearing my t-shirt, somebody was able to call out to me that they've been looking for AdvoCare. So that's training point number one, wear your colors. Training point number two, follow up. So this person had actually spoken to another person about AdvoCare. And I want to tell you that when he said that to me, I actually said to him, oh, we're not in the business of stealing clients or customers from people. So, you know, whoever shared that with you, that's actually who you really should get back in contact with. And he said, well, I don't know her information. She took mine, but I've never heard back from her. I mean, I, I couldn't believe that. She took the time to spark somebody, get his information, yet never followed up. Uh, blows my mind, but I guess it happens. Um, and then the number three training that I want to share with you guys is this, is that he had a friend standing next to him. And his, and uh, he, he, you know, said, this is my friend so-and-so. And, and I said, great, nice to meet you. Would you like a sample too? And, and he said, yes. And I said, okay, great, let me get your information because I'd love to follow up with you and see how you enjoy that spark. And he said, no, no, thank you. I don't want to give you, give you that. And uh, I said, well, then you need to give me my drink back. And, you know, some of you might think, wow, that was bold, but you know what? I'm not in the business of just handing out money. Um, if I'm going to give you a spark, you're going to give me something in return because I want to make sure that I follow up with you properly. That's the whole purpose of giving somebody a sample of spark. And so he actually gave that back, no hard feelings, told him that, you know, if he's ever interested, obviously his friend Sean has my information and, uh, and that he can get in touch with me. The last bit of training that I really want to highlight here is, you guys, is that using social networking to to promote your business. You know, we talk a lot about using Facebook. Yes, Ian and I have used Facebook to promote our business, but make sure you're using it properly. You know, this person had said, you know, gosh, I, I know a couple of people who are, are selling AdvoCare on Facebook, um, but none of them have ever actually reached out to him and shared AdvoCare with him. So here's a gentleman who's going to be purchasing the 24 day challenge from us, probably becoming a distributor, likely getting on some of the Performance Elite products, all because Everyone else there planted seeds um, of third-party credibility, but not a single person actually took the time to follow up or actually spark him properly or talk to him. And so, you know, first and foremost, thank you to whoever that was out there because now we've got a brand new customer and a new distributor on our team. But the training in that is, is who, who are you doing these things with? Are you sparking somebody properly? Are you wearing your colors? Are you using Facebook to your advantage? So ask yourself those questions and just remember to go out there, go, put a smile on your face, wear your colors, and represent Team AdvoCare. We love you guys.